to put this banner together. So double-sided tape. First, I make sure that this is all flat. And you can actually either flip it over or keep it like this. So you just line it up as close as you can to the top. I flatten it out with my hand to make sure there's enough contact. This is just like a preliminary rub down for it first, just to make sure there's enough contact. And then trim it. And then what I do is I, I pre-roll it. Then I peel it back. And then I actually hold down right here, like give it pressure to make sure the tape stays on the, on the back of the banner. And then I just keep on pulling up and it pulling up pushes my finger forward and keeps it nice and uh, basically tight against the material and the adhesive. And then I usually start in the middle. Everyone probably does this differently. Um, I just line it up with the color and then just kind of guide the material with my hand. And obviously this takes a good amount of time to go that fast. I mean, I can go much faster when the camera's not on my face, but, and then you just take the roller and go all the way through it. And then to get to the other side, I just simply go like this, spin it. You can easily walk around the table too, if you want, it's up to you. And then I'll flip the edge over and make sure it's nice and flat first before I put the tape on. and just repeat this step. Just making sure the tape is completely contacted to the back of the banner. And then roll it so it gets a nice contact on the back and then pull back up on the back of the tape and then allow it like leaving some pressure to peel it back. I'll go quicker, see if I can go quicker this one. And then start in the middle it's easy when there's an actual border so that way you can quickly identify the edge of it because when you do white um, there's only like these markers here once in a while every printer is different ours has little markers for the grommets so you can kind of tell where your edge is going to be if it's a white background and then i fold it back out and take the roller i'll start like this to go one direction and then i'll start going this way this direction so i'm not going to get stuck in the middle at all okay for the edging do it a couple different ways. You can fold it over like this and do it, or you can fold the whole thing over, which I usually do. And then I can go and do one side like this. And this one, I'm not gonna pre-roll because it's a little shorter. I'm just gonna hold down pretty tight. To get the other side, I just flip the whole print over. All right, and then now, after we roll this, we do the grommeting. And then I just usually slide it down, pull it up, and then we get our grommeter, which is over here. And now the back of the banner will actually show the grommet location mark um, i generally know where it's going to be without looking well, I, mean, I still look but usually when i position the grommet machine it's usually somewhat in the oh, okay so i say that and i screw up um, but i usually know where to place the grommet machine so that should be like right here like i said this is very hard to see with okay i'm over here with uh, my camera in my face also not wearing my glasses so it's a little bit difficult to see because I can't film and look at the camera at the same time with the glasses this close to my face. Just do the same thing, fold it back on itself, spin it, drag it back out. You could usually get this thing done within a couple minutes. I'd say like five minutes is a good time per print. Um, you know, the goal would be, I think, about three minutes. You know, obviously going fast is not always ideal. You don't want to screw it up. Having a better looking product, taking an extra couple of minutes is way more important. Um, you know, when we have hundreds, you know, the minutes do really matter. So if we have like a 500 order, depending on the size, you've got to keep those minutes at a certain time. And then you can always roll this up real loosely. And that's how we make a vinyl banner. Thank you so much for joining me.